Phew, sure is nice to rest my paws by Tosey Hearth after a tough task. We made solid progress on that grain shed today. You know, your construction. I'm impressed. Ah, oh, I'm no master smith like you. Can't do any of that fancy foraging or enchanting or any of that. I'm just glad to roll up my sleeves and pitch in, is all. Hope we'll get that shed good and ready before the next time beasts cut off the supply lines to Bridgebury. Doubtless we will. Task goes so much faster with the second set of paws moving in perfect tandem. It's been a long time since I've worked like that. My grandchildren help where they can, but... I'm sorry, ma'am. I didn't mean to bring up hard memories for you. You didn't. I think of my sister each time I hold a hammer. Aw, now we have Poppy. <laughs> Hello, the internet. Saf right here, and I just go right back in the beast breaker. So. Aha! <laughs> and in goes the fresh pop seed oil. Oop, watch the splatter. Where is the backup saucepan? <laughs> Whatever, just gonna swap in the stew pot and... Hey, Skip, could you toss me a knife for three? My kitchen also accepts magical swords if that's all you got. I mean, beast, parsnips, same difference, right? They all deserve a thorough smashing. Poppy, don't fret. My brilliant plan is practically ready. I'll catch you before you head out. Promise. Okay. Um, anything in the forge? Um, I can craft. Unlock new sword and shield. Volatic blade. Yep, on bounce. Deal eight damage. Stop on core bounce. Oh. Till first bounce, gain one block, deal one damage. If possible, lose 10 block. If block is spent, deal three damage in a medium radius. Hmm. Okay. Nothing else to craft. Anything in the cellar? Yep, we can go on an expedition. Taste snack alert. We've got crispy wheat puffs, sweet seed scramble, glazed mushroom strips, all boxed up and adventure ready. So, so much. This isn't just another chore, Skip. You're saving the world. We're not going to make you do it alone. And though you might find gnawing on raw roots, your epic team should have epic snacks. The lass is right. We're the, when the going gets tough out there, you may find you get much further with a friend. Skipper, if you need scouting expertise or bow backup, I'll be glad to lend a paw. And who else will go forage for you or serve berry batter cookies mid-battle? So which of us will you take? This is a very difficult decision. <laughs> yeah, he's funny. <laughs> All right, Old Twig Market calls for aid. Travel companions. Companions have tracking powers and battle powers. They will also reset the beast rampage counter once per battle. All right, um, introvert time. No, let's pick a companion. Um, let's take John Quill for now because I don't know that I need, like, I've been doing okay as far as damage. So we're good at that. We're good for that. I'm okay. Let's depart. Oh, I didn't put in my new sword and shield. Mm, oh, well. <laughs> Look at their little... I love their little avatars on there. It's so cute. Oh, there's the critter. Where is it? Okay, it still seems to be a ways off. Oh, dang it! I was just going back to the market, too! Drat! All right, let's try again. Oh, dang it, I forgot to switch my weapon again. Cuss. All right, that's fine. Oh, um. Bring it on. We're going to take it. These cats are kind of rough, but we'll get it. It's good. Said I wish I'd equipped my new weapon the second time, even. Oh. Oh, he's complicated. <laughs> His scales take multiply hits. Yes, rampage in four turns. We're not getting him down in four turns. <laughs> Okay, there. now we're making the bouncies. Oh, 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 hold on. That was almost a perfect shot. And then I had to bump it. Yeah, let's play in there for a little bit. Yeah. Ooh, am I out of range? I was too, but he's gonna run. 
I there's no way I'm getting him down in however many turns. It's just not happening. Yeah, even trying to reset his rampage, like right there, I guess. Okay, so there we've got one reset. Ooh. All right, well, let's, oh, oh, that's a material. I'm like, what it, but yeah, we can grab that. Yeah, pinball around in there for a while. Um, oh, let's see if we can't. Oh, yeah. Can we get in there? Yes. <sighs> they kicked me right out, though. I did manage to apply the cracked. Inch, 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 inch. Can we get stuck in there? Oh, yeah. Look at that. Yeah. Okay, let's do a defensive charge, because I think I'm going to get stuck. Let's bounce a bit. Whoops. No. Okay, that's good. Oh, nope. I think we're just out of range. Awesome. We might pull this off. We might. Okay, we got a plus 20, so let's do a shield bash. Didn't get as many materials, but we took it down. So that's okay then. Okay, this time, let's try our new toys. Yes, and I'm okay with John Quill. Okay, let's go back here quick. Is he not gonna move? Oh, I was gonna say. All right, let's take it down. Bring it on. We don't need to avoid it. No, 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 no. <clears throat> okay, once the electric shirts, if possible, lose 10 block. If black is spent, deal 3 damage in medium radius. Let's try it. Oh, okay, well, never mind. <laughs> and now I'm stuck back here. <laughs> Now the battle is on. Yeah, nope, we're not getting this one. He's gonna rampage. I do have one more strike. That was nice. Okay, and then the yep. up. Okay. Okay, thanks, John Quill. Okay, so now I got five more turns to start, like, seriously doing stuff here. This way. That way. There we go. Okay, excellent. Let's see if I can get... Can I get... If I bounce off that arc... Yeah, it's not going to get what I need it to do. Whoops! <laughs> I didn't expect a complete 90 degree angle. <laughs> I guess I should have known better. You know, let's do the electric surge. Little bit. Oh, there. Excellent. Okay, and then if we come in here, I should be able to bounce and get that, right? Nope. Not quite, not quite. We're almost there, though.
Oh, whoops. Okay. Not exactly what I wanted, but we'll do it. It'll do. Okay, so that should reset the rampage at least. Buy us a little time. Oh, he's got rampage imminence. Ah, oh, geez, that was the worst place for those to go. Okay, deal eight damage. Yeah, we just had, otherwise he was going to be gone, so take what I can get. Oh! So you're telling me an ominous silhouette of stranger has been hanging around? And you're just letting them slither off without asking like a billion questions? I mean, what if there's some brooding nefarious villain? No, wait, too obvious. Oh, maybe they're secretly a heroic spy for the queen. Oh, oh, they could be a tiny sentient beast of disguise. Okay, maybe not that one. But seriously, Skip, if you feel tongue-tied, let me know. And next time they show up, I'll ask them anything. You shouldn't have to get tangled up in dangerous stuff we don't understand. Not without me, anyway. <laughs> I like her. <laughs> Although I like all the characters. I hear. Is there anything new I can craft? No, nope, nothing. Noble and neat. There may be somebody lost in Bramble Hollow. I'm going to do a couple just other random tasks. First, we'll, we'll get to that. So, then a little bit of grinding. But uh, now we're going to go back onto the story. So, Noble and Reed. There may be somebody lost in Bramble Hollow. Seems Paprika found a broken propeller out in Bramble Hollow. She's brought it back as scrap, but this alloy, metal like this is manufactured, not mined. And its newfangled battery is enchanted with so many sparks I can't make whisker tail of them. This isn't from around here. Must have fallen off those noble, noble caravans. Last time they resupplied the villages in the hollow. I need to hear rumor that a fancy fellow was flitting about recently, bolstering defenses with tech donations. We can always look around the last settlement he was helping in case that caravan is still around. Maybe he needs a bit of defending himself. I can do it. We can do it. Um, I'm okay with that setup. I'm all right with that. No sign of anyone yet. Okay, well, let's grab materials quick. Oh, there it is. Hey. Take heart, assistance. We shall swiftly return to the cloud once we reconfigure the important bits. Mortifying. How are citizens to depend on the hovering estates if our finest caravan was so easily felt? I mean, really. This is absurd. I shall have words with the manufacturer the moment I get home. I mean... Oh, oh, wait. That is easy to say. If I get home. I'm here! Alright, let's do... Yeah, let's do the acid. I like that. Ah, there it is. Okay, I'm gonna lumber back here real quick. I want to do a heal potion. Okay, here we go, because if it gets any closer, we're gonna lose the town, so bring it on! Bring it on! Sneak attack and it's a tor- and we fought these before and before, so, you know. Get in there, just start doing some real damage. Yeah, on the plus side, that extra bonus was right there, so we got that, too. Oh! We- oh, no, that's right, I forgot. When we have a potion, we have to end our turn. Okay. We'll get that bonus right away too again. Woo! Um, actually that initial angle is actually pretty good. Okay, you get weird on me sometimes here, controller. I'm sure this wasn't meant for controller. Oh, that was a bad spot to end. Oh dear. <laughs> Oops. Ouch! Yeah, because they were right back where we started. Ooh, can I sneak in there? Cracked! Nice! Yep, 
Excellent. I say, who is that? What an impressive showing. Rampage reset. Yeah, you're welcome. Oh, and then we're out of turns. Okay, actually, let's see if we can't get our item here. Eh, it still did a little bit. Nothing exactly great, although I really should get out of here. Yeah, let's do this. Excellent. Yes, go forth, heroic peasants. Strike a resounding blow. Rampage reset. Yep. Excellent. Almost as I planned. Almost. <laughs> okay, let's get in here and get our item. Okay, let's do a defensive charge. I want to kind of see how much damage I can do here. That was pathetic, but that's fu it's fine. Because, yeah, it's cracked, so I could be taking it out. Oh, not exactly where I wanted to end up, but this will be fine, because I should be able to take that out. No! Ooh, bad, 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 bad. Okay. I was hoping I could take out its front tooth there, but apparently not. Now we gotta start all over. Yeah, excellent. That's what I was looking to do the first time. Okay, now we end our turn here. Try to get as many resources as we can. Excellent. Well, I was trying to get the Shimmer. Let's do a defensive charge. Yep, because as I say, I'm going to end up right back in his attack zone. I wanted to get that item. That's all. That's all. And yeah, and I could end it. I am deliberately going around so I can get more more, 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 more materials. Oh, there he goes. All done. Um, you, okay. Congratulations, heroic warrior. You've had the honor of rescuing one of the most vital caravans of our fleet. Now I have the great joy of inducing myself. I am the most honorable Lord Dandelion. Glorious du Fritillaria the Fifth. Heir to the Marquis of Summercrest in the hovering estates of the cloud. But please, do call me Dandy. I wish to keep the fanfare to a minimum while down here to focus on those whom it is my duty to aid. Now, once I finish redirecting this caravan, let us adjourn to a safer location to continue our introduction. What a lovely little farm. And look, hand-painted windowsills. Imagine. It must be... Oh, it must be rustic compared to your own home, your lordship. Skipper shouldn't have dragged you out here, really. No, no, it is positively charming. Please, you needn't put yourself out on my account. And Skipper's actions have inspired me to think a critter who is capable of fighting the beast head-on. Besides, the very reason I tour the land is my duty to aid the populace. I shall begin unpacking forthwith. More resources would help, but... Oh, moats preserve me. I'll make room for them somewhere. <laughs> the little farmhouse is going to have all these critters in it. Lord Dandelion Gladios du Fritatola the Fifth, heir to the Marquis of Summercrest. <laughs> nice. Granny. Molts preserve me. Paprika, why are you in my forge with a frying pan? For the last time, the anvil is not a grill. Don't worry, Granny. I'm not going to repeat the pancake party. We are making skip tons of rad weapons, so I thought why only focus on battle? Just picture me voyaging across the land with the help of the snazzy spatula, the glimmering griddle, or the most epic kitchen tool of all, the fantastical frying, flying frying pan. This frying pan works well. It's old. My sister forged it herself before back before the beast came. Oh yeah, like I said, super old. Sparks are precious and travel is dangerous. Be reasonable, Paprika. I know, I know, quite and reasonable. Just like you and Skipper. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing like, oh, I can craft this bow. I, fine, I'll craft it. It'll make you happy. I don't like it though. Don't like the bows. 
Oh, Thunderheads, I've just received a missus that one of the aircrafts in my caravan never made it back to the cloud. Fortunately, it was fully automated and no one was aboard. But it contained the urn that I was transporting for my family. And urn? Indeed, an enchanted augmenty something or other. To device the device that was powering my philanthropic mission. When you next venture forth to the hollow, would you keep watch for any clues to its location? Sure! Oh, clues. Some quests can only be unlocked by following trail clues. They will appear during tracking while you are answering calls for aid. Oh! Okay, so now we have all sorts of things. Um, but I think I'm gonna have to just end it there. I'm really enjoying this game. I like it. Uh, you know, it gets to be a little grindy and a little repetitive, but it's not bad. I like the gameplay, so it's enough to keep me intrigued. But otherwise, I'll end the episode here. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, ring that bell, subscribe, leave a comment, all that good stuff. Otherwise, I hope you enjoyed it. I will see you all later.